A local man is making it his mission to get sidewalks installed on a busy road in Delhi Township. He says he drives the road every day and the sidewalk is needed because there's a lot of car and foot traffic. Fox 47's Megan Heiler reports. I'm standing here along Eifert Road where lots of people walk and bike alongside every day. Now there's a sidewalk down the street, but not one here, which residents say is the problem. I see a guy on the shoulder over here and it was the Shimmy Darko. He was wearing dark clothes and I couldn't see him. I actually had my brights on too. And I almost said I had to swerve around him so the boy from hitting him. That was a few days ago when Charles Runyon was coming home from work. The close encounter scared him, but then he saw something else that was alarming. But then yesterday I also noticed a lady walking her baby on, on the shoulder too. And that right there, that, that was extremely dangerous. Runyon wants the sidewalks to stretch all the way down the road for people walking and biking and not just parts of it. The township says adding sidewalks usually requires a grant or one is added as a result of new infrastructure or updates. The township adds if homeowners want to add one by themselves, they can by all means. They just need to get a permit from the Ingham County Road Department. These weren't the answers that Runyon was looking for. Why should our tax dollars continue to go into pouring, pouring this money in when nothing's being done? That's not right. It's not right for the American people. It's not right for the Michigan. It's not right for Michiganders. The township says that they value safety and want to help but add that sidewalks are expensive and the funding just isn't there. Runyon says he plans to get more people involved and take his worries back to the township. He says he'll keep fighting because he believes that lives are more important than money. I'm a taxpayer and I'd rather have my taxpayer dollars go toward building a sidewalk than someone's funeral because they sued. And the township added that they do budget some funds each year to sidewalk repairs that are not ADA compliant. Reporting from Delhi Township, I'm Megan Heiler, Fox 47 News. Delhi Township says its non-motorized transportation plan guides the process as to where sidewalks get installed. It was most recently revised in 2016 with public input. The only grant funding available for sidewalks is typically through the Safe Routes to School program.